Hi right, guys, Flex5101, Esteban here with the tips and tricks. So today, let's go ahead and make a component. We want to introduce components, parts, pieces, whatever it may be, into our drawing to make sure that our structures make sense, right? So in this case, it's a very simple table where the pieces are going to be fed from the back for the operator to use. And we're going to use the, a bin. So we want to go ahead and draw a bin. And we're going to draw the bin at 16 and a half by 12 inches. So I'm just going to draw a very basic bin here. And we're going to offset the top 0.25. Get rid of the uh, interior and the inside of this. 11.5. There we go. Very simple. Now, what I want to do before I continue, because if I modify my structure now and I regenerate my structure, well, we'll see what happens. If I generate this again, this that I just drew becomes a flex pipe structure, and that's not what I want, right? So, Control Z, head back a step. Now, I'm going to select, I'm going to right click my mouse, and I'm going to go ahead and make component. So, I'll go ahead and create a component like so and now whatever modification we do to this structure it's not going to affect the component uh, that I just drew so for instance now we can go ahead and maybe add a, uh, another level of uh, flow rack here let's just say we're gonna put this here at 16 down and we're going to go ahead and regenerate our structure. So there we go. We have the component still intact, and we were able to modify our structure. So make sure you right-click and make a component out of whatever it is that you're drawing to introduce into the structure. All right, guys. Take care. I'll see you next time.